This video describes how to add an MGA to QQ Catalyst. From anywhere within the program, you can click on New Contact from the dock. Set your contact type to Carrier's MGA Certs Liens. Select MGA and choose their current status. Select a designated location for this MGA and enter their contact information. Once you click Next, your MGA will be saved in your contacts. Now that you have entered the guided workflow, you may begin with entering phone numbers and email addresses for your MGA. Enter as many phone numbers and email addresses as you need. When you get to the addresses screen, enter all the information and make sure to select the proper address type. You can add as many addresses as you need. On the Business Information screen, enter the necessary information for your MGA. In the Business Contact screen, once you've added a contact and saved it, you can edit it or remove it. From the drop-down list, select the carriers that are linked to this MGA. Note that you can add multiple carriers that are linked to this MGA. If the carrier is not listed here, then you may stack so that QQ Catalyst will remember this place and then go add your carrier through the New Contact screen. For instructions on how to add a carrier, please see the video on that topic. When you have entered all the MGA information and clicked Finish, the guided workflow for this contact will be complete. A contact has now been created. At this point, you can view and edit MGA information, view activities, and even send emails to this MGA. Here is what you've just seen in this video. How to add an MGA using the guided workflow, how to navigate through the guided workflow, and how to stack.